Wednesday, April 15, this two-year-old beagle came in with a very much swollen left eye two days ago and half swollen right eye. Now it's two days after treatment and hospitalization. You can see that the left eye is still red, reddish. Now you can see the sclera. Sclera is reddish. I can see it compared to uh, the left eye, not compared to the right eye. Now the right eye, the sclera, is white. You can see, it's white. So you can see that the injury from some chemicals onto the left eye is severe. Now, you look at the other video, the left eye has a big ulcer from across the eye, from left to right, that means 3 o'clock to 9 o'clock in the center of the cornea. Now, without the fluorescent, fluorescent stain, we can't tell. But now I will check again before going home. We will use the fluorescent sodium stain to do the check. So we will do on both eyes. Okay, so now my assistant will put one drop. One drop. Wait, come. Okay, 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 okay. Slowly, slowly. No, it seems like he doesn't like it. Yeah. Okay, so we'll do slowly. Just put one drop. Better than a strip, yeah. Uh, okay, one drop. And the other eye, normally you should do two eyes, but uh, it's better not to just do one eye because sometimes you don't know whether the other eye has ulcers or not, cornea ulcer. Now, this test is, is used for checking cornea ulcers or abrasions in the eye. Now, this will take about one minute if the cornea is, is uh, ulcerated, has two days ago, it, that, there's another video, uh, you will see green. Now, as you can see now, the cornea is not green. Let's see the other eye. The cornea is not green. So the ulcer, the superficial keratitis has almost healed, but not yet. I can see the cornea is cloudy earlier on before we put the fluorescent stain, but uh, it's not green. So that means it's superficial ulcers. Yeah. So now we put the eye drops to clear the fluorescent, fluorescent drops. Okay, one drop, and then the other side as well to clear, clear the drops. Yeah. Okay, then we will check again one more time before the dog goes home. Now, just use the tissue to clean up first. Okay, so we'll check. Any green? Any greener? Yeah, greener. Huh? The center. The center of the cornea. Yeah, this cornea is still, is still inflamed, but not so bad as that day. Let me see. Any greeners or not? Yeah, it's less green than, than uh, let me see, than that day. That day was very green. So the ulcer is not so deep, not so extensive from 3 to 9 o'clock. Okay, let's see the other eye. This eye should be much better. Yeah. So you compare the two eyes, and uh, this eye is definitely, the cornea is clear. Let me see here, yeah. So we see the cornea is clear and the uh, sclera, the eye white is, is not congested. Now we go back to these eyes. Now I see whether the camera can pick up the green or not. Because it's not very uh, serious. So we, we can't see clearly but uh, definitely there's much healing and, uh, uh, and ulceration 
if compared to the previous video, it's not so uh, so uh, obvious now. Two days after treatment, uh, with uh, IV Dexa, Metasone plus eye drops, you can see now. Can you see any green mm. center? Huh? No, mm. don't have. Huh? Mm. Don't have green, right? Yeah, don't, don't have. Don't have. So we. So only thing they say the sclera is still inflamed. They can see they're all red and congested. So that, that chemical <coughs> is quite quite the uh, quite painful to the eye. So the dog can go home with uh, painkillers and uh, <coughs> eye drops and the e collar. So you wear the e collar for the dog. And uh, if it goes home, should be indoors and to rest because it's not fully recovered yet. As you can see the sclera on the left eye is still reddish and congested. This is the <coughs> pre going home examination for the owner. The owner will bring him back today, two days after hospitalization. To apply your vets, cornea, ulcer, left eye. Singapore.